breathing. It's something most of us take for granted, but for others, just this simple task of taking air in and out gets harder as they age. More than 100,000 seniors suffer from something called idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis, or IBF. But as News 8's Ann Sterling reports, there is no cure, but now doctors are one step closer to stopping its progression and reversing it. Most of us take about 16 breaths a minute. That's 960 breaths an hour. 23,000 breaths a day and 8 million breaths a year. But some don't take a single breath for granted. Idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis is, is a lung disease in which the lungs form scar tissue. There's no known cause for IPF. They either get a lung transplant or succumb to the disease within five years. The prognosis is worse than many cancers. Researchers at Cedar sinai have now identified a root cause of IPF. They found stem cells lining the air sacs in the lungs lose their ability to process zinc. Zinc is, a, is an essential mineral. It's a nutrient that's used uh, for a lot of cellular processes. IPF lungs are missing a protein called zinc transporter 8, or ZIP8, which draws zinc into the cell. When researchers fed mice zinc supplements, their fibrosis improved. When they added a combination of NAD plus and sirtuin one activators, all of which are supplements sold over the counter, the fibrosis improved, even reversed. The idea of potentially um, improving lung function is, is something that really gets me out of bed in the morning. Giving a breath of hope to thousands of people. With your health, I'm Ann Sterling. Next, Dr. Noble and his team hope to develop a clinical trial and are hopeful the treatment could not only help treat IPF, but could also be a treatment for long COVID and other respiratory illnesses. And our coverage of health news can also be found at WQAD.com. Just head over to our website and you'll find your health in the search bar at the top of the page, along with all of our other Your Health stories in that section of WQAD.com.